Before this video starts, I want you guys to know all the clips from this were in quick match. I'm not going into newcomers as I state in this video. It's not fair and don't take me like that. I'm just trying to show you guys how to make a smurf. Thank you. What's up guys and today I'm going to show you guys how to make a alternate account and before we even get into anything remember these aren't for destroying new players don't just play newcomers match don't do any of that if that's your intent with this click off the video I don't want you in here if you're just going to go play the new people in the game and destroy them there's no fun in that this is solely for being your alternate account if you want to maybe have an account where you don't play with your friends and just see how high you can get in, in ranked and all maybe asking how you're actually ever going to get to rank 30 if you can't play newcomers just play quick matches that is more fair the newcomers match your game mode is actually for newcomers don't mess around with that and don't try to take abuse of the try to get out of the the low ranks as fast as you can and then work your way up. Don't try and stick around and destroy those new people. But without, with that out of the way, I'm gonna tell you guys why. I have a alternate account or a Smurf account, whatever you wanna call it. I have it for this channel, actually. I'm gonna be starting something coming next season, so stay tuned for that if you wanna see why I'm using this alternate account. But basically, I'm gonna use it for a series, so I just gotta get to level 30. I'm only using quick matches, so don't worry. I'm not trying to hurt the game by any means or hurt the new players. I want them to do the best they can, so. I just play quick matches and unranked, so that's all I really worry about. Play the situations, play terrorist hunts, that's how I'm getting ranked up. And that's how you should get ranked up if you have this and you're actually a good player. But a lot of people on Steam or on the Reddit forums and such don't know how to actually make an alternate account, which amazes me. A lot of people think that you actually don't need to buy the game again, but that's completely false. You need to buy the game again, and you should buy the game again, as you are a new user, technically, so you're going to have to buy the new game again. So all you're going to need is a new email, right? And you can just go to Gmail and whatever and make it, make your email, then put to or smurf or whatever the heck you want to put. Then you make a new Steam, make a new Uplay also, obviously. If you make a new Steam, you got to make a new Uplay, so... You also might be asking maybe why are you making this video five years into the game? Well, there's a big promotion right now that ends March 26th where you can get the game for $7.99 or the deluxe version for $9.89, which I totally recommend as you will have basically every one, year one and two operators, which is awesome. Gives you a good head start if you're trying to start another account for whatever reason. So that's good. And once you make your new Steam account, all you have to do is just buy it and then launch the game. You don't have to re-download the game or anything i know a lot of reddit users and stuff i tried to just look up like how to do this in general and a lot of them said you need two game files and whatever but you don't i have the season pass on my other account and not on this one and it still works just fine loads up just fine so all you have to do is buy it and then launch it from your ubisoft and you'll be good to go just make sure that you aren't abusing this this is how you do it it's really simple this is gonna be a short video but it's really really simple also keep in mind have an actual reason to be doing this i'm doing it for content obviously for this channel and solo queuing and stuff so that's why i'm doing it you guys need a reason too i don't want to see a bunch of people going into newcomers that's not cool people do that already and it's just kind of toxic honestly gets the new players out of the game and it's honestly going to kill the life of the game if everyone does that how you expect to learn how to play the game if you are getting molested by a bunch of plat threes and stuff but anyway that's all for me hit the notification bell if you guys want to see what's going to be coming in void edge for this channel but if not uh hopefully this helped and i'll see you in the next one